Mr. Chandler, what exactly was your relationship with this police chief that was forced to resign? This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by Freekeen.com. Gentlemen, to what extent are you here to lobby against my freedom today? Representative, I have a question for you. To what extent is the state responsible, to some extent, for the deaths in the opioid crisis by making drugs illegal and driving them underground where they're more dangerous? Well, I would say maybe stem from a long time ago where we didn't rise to the occasion and all the recovery centers for addiction disappeared. So we're finally having to step up to the plate, but we really need to concentrate on prevention. I'm on the board of an organization called Communities for Alcohol and Drug Free Youth in Plymouth, and, and we work intensely on getting high school kids and junior high school kids not to, to go that way in the first place. And we, our town's lost people too, we lost young people. To what extent, though, is going back in the direction of more treatment and so forth, taxpayer funded treatment in some cases, to what, to what extent is that arm wrestling against yourself? Because, I mean, again, you're creating the dangerous drugs indirectly by making them illegal and driving them underground. Well, if it starts, of course, with the pres prescription drugs, well, I, I and, um, and that leads to something. I think a state does have a responsibility to provide recovery. All right, Ms. Cooney, I appreciate your time. I think I've heard of you. I've never, never seen you before. All right, take care. Well, Mr. Toll, tell, tell me if I'm wrong, but I understand that you do support most drug laws. Is that correct? Yes, not necessarily in the condition they're in right now, but yes. But to what extent does that make you inadvertently responsible for some of the drug deaths that we've been having because of the fact that you're driving drugs underground where they're more dangerous? Those are choices the individuals make, not me. All right, take care. Thanks for the answer. Mr. Chandler, what exactly was your relationship with this police chief that was forced to resign? Wasn't your police chief in Bartlett forced to resign? Aren't you in the Bartlett government? In the Bartlett government? I don't know. I guess so, yeah. You said that the new chief, things are in good hands with the new chief, but uh, you were in charge when the last chief was, well, not in charge, but you were in the government when the last chief was present. Did you do anything to get him out? or? Take the facts here for themselves. Representative, was that you just saying you look down on people who use drugs? You're aware that a, a, a majority of Americans have used drugs, right? Do you look down on the majority of Americans? Are you a liberty activist willing to be on the front line against socialism? Freekeen.com would like you to consider moving here to Keen. While Keen may have the largest number of liberty-oriented media outlets in the entire state of New Hampshire, there's still a need for more activists. Can you help them? Visit Freekeen.com to see what's happening. Freekeen.com hooks you up with all the liberty media in town. Join the Keen Liberty Activists and help free the beautiful city of Keen, New Hampshire from the clutches of the government. Freekeen.com